Between Christmas gift giving and Super Bowl viewing prep, December and January are biggies for buying supersized TV sets. But these jumbo flat screens present an eye-opening danger. Unfortunately, we're seeing a trend with the TV tip overs. The TVs, nowadays people are getting the flat screen TVs and they're not as sturdy, so children are able to knock them over. The number of kids injured by a falling TV grew 125 percent between 1990 and 2011, according to ER records. Toppling TVs send a child to the hospital in the U.S. on average every 30 minutes. Most at risk are children five and under. They don't understand the consequence of pulling on the top of a tall object and most of those things are very, very heavy, and once they start toppling, there's no stopping them. The increase in injuries, even deaths, result from a combination of more TVs in the home, bigger TVs, and older TVs that are kept on dressers and shelves which aren't designed to hold them. Experts say these accidents are preventable. You kind of want to look at things from a small person's perspective. If something can wiggle, then you want to make sure it's tacked down. Most new furnishings can be mounted and keeps things from tipping. The Safe Kids initiative suggests you mount flat screens to the wall, keep old style TVs on low stable furniture, and use brackets, braces, or wall straps whenever possible. And and remember, when it comes to the television, young children may try to get in on the action. Kids are curious. <laughs> For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.